Among food, South Karnataka people take ragi mud along with sambar. In case of veg, muddy has good combination with dal like basaru, sapina saru, etc. Similarly, in case of nonveg, muddy is a must for South Karnataka persons. For North Karnataka, jolata rati roti has a good combination with kempu red chutney and uchal chutney. Places like Udupi and Kodagu like dishes of dosa, idli, banda. Mangaluru peoples worship fish as god, their usual dish is fish along with rice. The cuisine of Karnataka includes many vegetarian and non-vegetarian cuisines. It is one of the oldest surviving cuisines and traces its origin to the Iron Age. Ragi is mentioned in the historical works of the great poet Adhikavi Pampa and in the ancient Sanskrit medical text Sushruta Samhita. The varieties of the Karnataka cuisine have drawn influence from and influenced the cuisines of neighboring states like Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh and Kerala. Some typical dishes include bisi bel bath, jolada roti, chapati, ragi roti, akki roti, saaru, idli, vada sambar, vangi bath, kara bath, kesari bath, ben dos, near dos, ragi unda, padu, gunponglu, koli saaru, chicken curry, kanada style, mamsa saaru, mutton curry, kanada style, and upatu. The well known masala dosa traces its origin to Udupi cuisine. Plain and Rava Idli, Mysore Masala Dosa and Madhurvade are popular in South Karnataka. Kodagu Korg district is famous for spicy varieties of pork curries while coastal Karnataka boasts of many tasty seafood specialities. Among sweets, Mysore Pak, Holaj, Obatu, Darwad Peta, Kunda, Chiroti, Sajig, Kadabu, Karjikai are well known. Although the ingredients differ from one region to another, a typical Kanadiga OOTA Kanadiga meal includes the following dishes in the order specified and is served on a banana leaf, uppu salt, kosambari, pickle, palia, goju, raita, dessert, thav, chitrana, rice, and ghee. After ghee is served to everyone, one may start the meal. This step is taken to ensure that everyone seated has been served completely. What follows next is a series of soup-like dishes such as saaru, mudipalya, majig huli or kutu, eaten with hot rice. Goju or raita is served next, then two or three desserts are served, and finally, fried dishes such as ambod or banda are served. The meal is completed with a serving of curd rice. There is some diversity in the core food habits of North and South Karnataka. While northern style dishes have jola and rice as the primary cereals, the south uses ragi and rice. Topic: <laughs> North Karnataka cuisine. The North Karnataka cuisine can be primarily found in the northern districts of Karnataka, which include Darwad, Bijapur, Gulbarga, Belgaum, Bidar, Yadgar, Bagalkot, Raichur, Devanjer, Gadig, Haveri, Kapil, and western and northern areas of Bellary. The cuisine is also considered a specialty in the cities of southern Karnataka, including Bengaluru, Tumakuru, and Mysuru, with several restaurants offering this cuisine to meet the growing demand. The following is the typical menu of a vegetarian northern Karnataka meal. Jolata roti. Thin flatbread usually made from jowar flour, baked on a fire or an iron skillet. Bajra and wheat flour is also used as an alternative. N gai, tumbu gai, small badan kai aubergine bulbs stuffed with dry stuffing including ground peanut, ground sesame, ginger, garlic, garam masala and salt, then sautéed with onions and other spices. Aubergine is also substituted with any other suitable vegetable. Popular sweets and desserts are shenga undined godi hug, peanut, sesame chutney. A variety of powder, dry chutney made from ground peanut or sesame. Kempu kara, also called ranjaka, chutney paste made with, of red chilies, consumed as a condiment. Kosambari Bell or kalu palia dal, whole or sprouted kadale, hiseru, mung bean, lentils, cooked with greens such as methi, spinach, dill and scallion, and sautéed with onions, ginger, garlic and other spices. Rita bhaji, salad made from yogurt. Raw salads, of scallion, onion, green chili, methi leaves, sometimes with agarain of sassiv or jiraj. Anna, rice. Saaru, lentil soup made with pepper, cumin, coriander seeds, asafetida, tomatoes or tamarind. Papadam Dahi yogurt and buttermilk 
butter or ghee junka or pitla, salty masala cakes made from chana dal powder raw greens, spinach, methi fenugreek, and hikarike arugula. raw vegetables, radish, cucumber, onions, carrots, green chilies etc. South Karnataka cuisine The South Karnataka or Old Mysuru region also known as Bialusim or the Plains includes the present-day Kalara, Bengaluru, Mysuru, Tumakuru, Mandya, Hasana, Chamarajanagara. Ragi and rice are the most important staple grains, Jowar and Bajra are also cultivated and consumed in the drier parts of the region. The first meal of the day is breakfast, which is quite substantial. Regular meals consists of ragi mud or steamed dumpling made from ragi flour, a curry to roll bits of the dumpling often called saaru, rice and yogurt. Optional accompaniments include a salad called kosambari, various paliyas fried, boiled or sautéed spicy vegetables and assorted pickles. Formal vegetarian meals are usually served in a particular order and required to be consumed in a particular order as well. These meals are served on plantain leaves or mutica leaves, dry tandu-like leaves staples together into big circular discs. First accompaniments are served which includes a variety of palia, kosambari, sweet savory goju, hot spicy chutney pickles, bhaji, banda, vade, papads. The first course alternates between sweets and rice preparation. The second course is a set of curries to be consumed with rice. It generally starts with tav, a mild lentil dish laced with ghee, majig huli, vegetables simmered in a mild yogurt sauce, followed by huli, lentils and vegetables spiced and tempered with ghee, mustard, asafetida and curry leaves. This is followed by tili saaru, which is a thin lentil stock, spiced and laced with ghee and curry leaves. The final course of the meal is rice and curd with pickles. Buttermilk is also served to be consumed at the end of the meal. Mysuru is also famous for its sweet, Mysur pak, made of milk, sugar, ghee and gram flour. The hilly district of Kodagu Korg also has its own unique cuisine which includes spicy meat pandi pork curry, chicken, mutton, kadumbut round balls made of rice, paput, thaliaput. The spicy meat curries derives a tangy taste from kokum kachampuli. Karnataka cuisine, common to all regions Some common vegetarian dishes prepared on a regular basis are Rice dishes Bisi bel bath – rice cooked with lentils, vegetables and spices, like huli with rice, but often richer Vangi bath cooked rice mixed with eggplant cooked in oil and spices. The eggplant is usually cooked into a palia beforehand and the vangi bath mixed before serving. Chitrana cooked rice flavored with spices, particularly oil popped mustard seeds and turmeric. Mosharana curd rice sometimes given a fried spicy touch with fried lentils and oil popped mustard seeds. Puliyogare cooked rice flavored with spicy tamarind paste. Mavinkai chitrana – cooked rice flavored with raw green mango and spices Nimbakai chitrana – cooked rice flavored with lemon and spices Avalaki – akki – means rice, avalaki is baked flat rice that is soaked briefly and stir-fried with cumin seeds, turmeric powder, peanuts, onions, green chilies, garnished with shredded coconuts and cilantro leaves. Mandaki – puffed rice that is soaked briefly and stir-fried with cumin seeds, turmeric powder, peanuts, roasted ground grams, onions, green chilies, garnished with shredded coconuts and cilantro leaves. Doses Ben dose or butter dose, originating from central Karnataka city of Devanger Mysore masala dosa Set dosa – thick pancakes made of rice batter garnished with a hint of coriander leaves, grated carrot and coconut, served with sagu and coconut chutney. Sagu masala dosa – dosa stuffed with sagu Masala dosa – butter and non-butter variants inside of the dosa is smeared with red chutney made of onion, red chili and garlic, stuffed with aloo gad palia made of potato and onion. Godi dosa or dosa made from wheat Ragi dosa or dosa made from ragi 
Rave dose or dosa made from rave. Topic: <inaudible> Breads. Ragi roti, a flat thick pancake made with ragi dough and flavored with chilies and onions. The dough is shaped and flattened by hand. Akki roti, a thick, flat pancake-like dish made with a dough of rice flour, chilies, onions and salt, the dough is shaped and flattened by hand. Jolada roti, a flat pancake dish made with a dough of sorghum flour and salt, the dough is shaped and flattened by hand. Jowar may be sometimes replaced with bajra. Ragi unda steamed dumplings made by adding ragi flour to boiling water. Gunpingalu, also known as Gundupangla, main kavali skillet with houses, or padu. It is made with a rice batter similar to dose and cooked in a special skillet with compartments. Sajay roti, bakri, a thick, flat pancake-like dish made with a dough of pearl millet flour and salt, the dough is shaped and flattened by hand and sprinkled with sesame seeds. <laughs> Chutneys. Kadalakai chutney – roasted peanuts, groundnuts ground with dry red chilies. May have garlic and be tempered with hot oil fried mustard and curry leaves. Harali chutney Kai chutney – grated coconut ground with dal kadale, salted and garnished with oil fried mustard and curry leaves. Kai chutney – green – grated coconut ground with dal, green chilies and coriander salted and garnished with oil fried mustard and curry leaves. Kai chutney red grated coconut chutney ground with dal and dried red chilies salted and garnished with oil fried mustard and curry leaves Mavina chutney grated raw green mango ground with grated coconut dal salted and garnished oil fried mustard and curry leaves Hirakai chutney grated ridge gourd peel ground with grated coconut dal salted and garnished oil fried mustard and curry leaves Aruli chutney, grated onion peel ground with grated coconut, dal, salted and garnished oil fried mustard and curry leaves. Adina bell chutney, fried black gram dal with tamarind, red chilies, salted and garnished oil fried mustard and curry leaves. Pudina chutney, fried pudina leaves along onion, ground nut, black gram, green chili, tamarind. Add sugar and grind to fine paste. Topic: Palia or side dishes. Harali kai palia. Harali palia. Harali hapala. Badnakai palia. Bendakai palia. Alugade palia. Balakai palia. Topic: Kosambari. A salad prepared using simple ingredients such as lentils, green chilies and finely chopped coriander. The dish is generally finished with a tempering of mustard seeds and a safetida. Common variants include kosambari made with the above ingredients in addition to grated cucumber or carrot. <laughs> Sweet and spicy dishes Manasinakai goju Hunyus goju, made with tamarind Bendakai goju, boiled okra ladyfinger cooked in a gravy sweetened with jaggery and soured with tamarind. Tomato goju, cooked cut or mashed tomato with a sweet sour gravy. Aruli onion and tomato goju, cooked cut or mashed tomato mixed with cut onion with a sweet sour gravy. Hagalakai goju, bitter gourd pieces marinated with salt and turmeric to remove some bitterness cooked with a sweet and sour gravy. Thondekai goju. Topic S A A R U gravy huli combination of vegetables and lentils simmered with spices, coconut, tamarind, and seasoned with ghee, asafetida, curry leaves, and mustard. It is an integral part of every formal meal. Majig huli cooked vegetables simmered in yogurt with coconut, spices, asafetida, curry leaves, and mustard. Tav mushi lentils cooked till creamy, spiked with spices and ghee. Vegetables are also added to this dish like ridged gourd, cucumber etc. Obatina saaru, made from the leftover broth while preparing the sweet obatu. Ba saaru, made from the broth of boiled lentils and spring beans mosopina, made from lentils and spinach maskai combination of vegetables cooked and mashed with spices and seasoning. 
Manasina Saaru, rasam made from pepper, turmeric, and other spices Bel Saaru, has tor dal as one of the ingredients Kaalina Saaru, legumes cooked with coconut, spices, tamarind and tempered with asafetida, curry leaves and mustard. Popular legumes include kadale kalu or chickpeas, halasande kalu black-eyed peas, hiseru kalu mung beans, harali kalu horse gram, aver kalu Indian beans hagalakai saaru, hagalakai. The Indian bitter gourd is simmered with coconut, tamarind and spices and spiked with jaggery and asafetida, curry leaves and mustard. The bitterness of the gourd is cut through by the sweetness of the jaggery and tartness of the tamarind. Goju traditionally this is thicker than the saaru but thinner than chutney. It is served with hot rice and is sweet, tangy and spicy. It is served in between courses as a palate cleanser. It is made from diverse ingredients including eggplants, okra, fenugreek, tamarind, pineapple, bitter gourd, tomatoes, lemon lime, etc. Udaka traditionally made in Chitradurga district only, served with ragi ball, made from boiling lentils and green leaves, then broth taken separate from lentil, herbs leaves with chutney herbs and spices then mixed with broth. Tambulai, a yogurt-based cold dish similar to raita made from dadapatra sapu. Optional ingredients in this dish includes vegetables and greens. Fish, mutton, chicken saaru, a very famous local curry made mainly from assorted spices and meats. Often mixed and eaten with ragi unda and rice or bakri. <laughs> Sweets Huggy, cooked rice and kadale or hiseru mung bean, with coconut, milk, alaki and sweetened with bella jaggery. Jinu, sweetened, flavored and steam-boiled colostrum of cow, buffalo or goat. Kajaya, rice and jaggery fritters deep-fried in ghee. Kadabu, deep-fried or steamed pastry with assorted sweet filling. Karjikai, deep-fried crisp pastry with dry sweet filling. Und, ball-shaped sweets with the following variations, chikina und, elu and bella Chigali und, made from elu Ar rave und, made from semolina Shenga und, made from peanut Mandaki und, made from mandaki Avalaki und, made from avalaki Hesarunde mung dal ladu Godiunde made from wheat Guladike und, made from maida and sugar, a devanger speciality Besanunde, made from besan Tambitu, made from rice or wheat flour and jaggery. Sikanunde, made from jaggery, dried coconut and maida, sakar akhu, little sugar statues, toys made during Sankranti. Halubai, a fudge made with ground rice, jaggery and coconut. Mysore pak, a fudge made with chickpea flour, sugar and ghee. Darwad peta milk scalded and thickened with sugar. Synonymous with darwad. Karadantu, Gokak town in Belgam district and Amingar of Hunagunda Taluk in Bagalkot district of Karnataka is famous for the Karadantu, the most famous form has a mixture of dry fruits and edible gum. Shikarani, pulp of ripe fruit usually mango or banana with additions such as sugar, alaki, jakai, japatri, milk, etc. Damratu, ash gourd toasted in ghee and simmered with sugar, milk solids and sweet spices. Kunda, prepared from thickened milk, a specialty from Belagavi Senaj Huggy, a very famous sweet made during Diwali in Shikarapur near Shimoga Sweet pastries, the following can be grouped together. These are often accompanied by milled sugar or warm milk flavored with saffron and almonds, mandage, huge flat leaven pastry. It is quite a treat to watch chefs making large greater than 36 inches in diameter pastries with bare hands and baking them on upturned clay pots over fire. This is an ancient dish mentioned in a few inscriptions as the Sanskritized Mandaka. For instance, a Western Chalukya inscription of AD 1121 mentions that Govinda Dandadhipa, a famous general of Vikramaditya VI, is said to have made a provision for offering this dish as Naivadya to Brahma, Vishnu and Maheshvara, at Pathage. Chiroti, fenori, unleaved, layered, sugar-coated fried sweets, shavij chiroti, vermicelli pastry, kesaribath, sira, this is made of rice or semolina in southern Karnataka cooked with sugar, jaggery, cardamom, saffron, milk, dry fruits mostly raisins, and sometimes fresh fruits like banana, mango and pineapple. Popularly colored yellow, orange, saffron or left white. 
In North Karnataka, the Semolina version is called Sihi Sajig or Shira or Sira. Kesaribath usually refers to the rice version. Hayagriva, a chickpea based dessert prepared on special occasions, popular amongst the Madhwa community. Paramana rice pudding with ghee and jaggery. Mamu puri flour, ghee, sugar, koa. First koa is packed between two halves of chapati then fried. It is exported mainly to Gulf. Maldi, a delicious sweet dish made of powdered baked wheat rotis, poppy seed, jaggery, hurricadal daria, and served with ghee. It is a must sweet on the occasion of marriages. Topic: <laughs> Pickles. Pickles are usually raw seasoned vegetables and seafood, but there are cooked varieties as well called bisi upanakai hot pickle. The seasoning varies from plain salt to spices like green chili, red chili powder, black pepper, whole and powdered mustard seeds, coriander seeds, etc. They significantly differ from North Indian pickles or achar in that considerably less oil is usually used in the pickles, salt is the main preservative. Mavinkai, raw green mango Midi mavinkai, immature raw mangoes, usually used whole Amtekai Nimbakai, whole and sliced lemon and lime. Gaja nimbakai, a larger variety of lemon, resembling a grapefruit. Betada nelikai. Nelikai. Tomato. Haralikai, a green citrus fruit, only the peel is used in the pickle. Hagalakai, bitter gourd. Prawn, shrimp and crab, especially in coastal areas. Avakaya. Avarake. Topic. Snacks Churamuri Pakoda Vedi, Ambode, Sabaki Vedi, Bel Vedi etc. Chakuli Nipatu Nuchina Und Kodubale Kara Mandaki, puffed rice mixed with kara commonly called as a mixture, onions, green chilies, coriander, dash of lemon and salt. Alugad banda, a banda made by deep frying lightly seasoned boiled mashed potato dipped in chickpea batter. Nargis mandaki, a puffed rice dish popular in central and north Karnataka, especially in Devanagari district. Menison kai bhaji, green chili bhaji, popular across the state of Karnataka. Dapa menison kai banda, capsicum banda. Bailey kai bhaji, raw unripe banana bhaji. Balaka, deep fried vegetable and fruit chips or wafers. The vegetables are usually dried and seasoned with spices, and even buttermilk. Common candidates are potato, sweet potato, yam, cassava, ripe jackfruit, banana, plantain, chili, bitter gourd, varieties of suitable green bean pods, usually gori kai, chale kai, etc. Chigali, honeys, tamarind chigali. Udupi cuisine Udupi cuisine takes its name from Udupi, a city on west coast of Karnataka. Udupi cuisine has its origin in Ashta Mathas of Udupi founded by Sri Madhvacharya. Its core is a vast range of creative dishes emphasizing local vegetables and fruits. Malinadu cuisine The Malinadu of Karnataka can be culturally divided on basis of food culture as South Malnad comprising northern Somawarpeet in North Kodagu, Sakelshapura, Mudajir, southern part of Chikamagaluru Taluk and western part of Bailur and Alor Taluks in Hassan. Central Malnad consisting of Chikamagalur, Kopa and the Malnad region of Shivmoga, and western Ghat regions of Uttara Kannada. Even though Western Ghat regions of Uttara Nada and Belagavi can be considered as Northern Malnad the food culture of these regions is unaware to the rest of Malnad, which may be due to inadequate communication with the other areas of Malnad and Karnataka. Although many refer to the Malinadu cuisine as an amalgam of Koorgi and Mangalorean cuisine, it has its own distinct style. The Kodava and the Bunt coastal Mangalorean regions are distinct from the rest of the Malnad region. The word Malinadu means Land of mountain ranges. The cuisine is heavily influenced by the variety of fruits and vegetables available in the rich forests of Western Ghats. 
The ingredients like tender bamboo shoots, colocasia leaves, turmeric leaves, and raw jackfruit are easily found in the Sayadri ranges. Steaming is the favored method of cooking in Malanadu. More often than not, there is little use of oils in Malanadu cuisine. Kalu kadabu, small kadubas dumplings as small as kalu beans made by pounding water-washed rice into powder and then steamed to make it sticky enough to make dumplings. Once the kadubas thousands in number are made as given typical malnad masale red chili, oil, mustard, graped coconut, jeera, little tamarind juice, curry leaves, salt to taste, etc. and served hot with hot thuppa homemade ghee from cows or buffalo's milk. Prepared around the region of Hanabalu, in Sakaleshpur Atalik of Hassan district. Chattitutu, an evening snack usually prepared by grinding rice with other ingredients such as chili, salt, coconut and tiny square sliced onions are added to make a thick mixture. Which then will be spread 1 half inch to 3 quarters inch thick and approximately 6 inches in diameter over thoroughly oiled bisi henchu hot tava once it becomes hard enough, kenda burning charcoal will be placed over it to crisp it. Prepared around the region of Hanabalu, in Sakaleshpur Atalik of Hassan district. Kote Kadabu Kadabu Chicken Saaru Chicken Fry Vothu Shavij with Chicken Curry Vothu Shavij with Gashgas Payasa or Kai Halu, steamed rice noodles with a sweet payasa or sweetened coconut milk. Vathashavij Upatu steamed rice noodles stir fried with oil, mustard seeds, onions, green chilies, and curry leaves. Akki roti, rice roti or flat bread made with rice Bamboo shoot pickle, kalule backquote upanakai Bamboo shoot curry, kalule backquote palia Halasina hanina kadabu, payasa Halasina hanina hapla Mavina midi upanakai Halasina hanina dos, jackfruit dos Akki tari kadabu, breakfast dish made with broken rice Gangala dos, steamed dosa Angu or thode daga, very thin sweet crepe made with a thin batter of rice and jaggery Kai holaj, a dessert made with fresh coconut, jaggery and maida Halu payasa, rice pudding, falvered with turmeric leaves and cardamom Halu hitu, semi-soft milk pudding made with milk, rice paste and sugar Kasina sapina palia, a side dish prepared using colocasia leaves as the main ingredient, served with akki roti. Kasuvina gantu a dish made by rolling tender colocasia leaves and making a gantu knot, sometimes a single hunk of rock salt and a garlic petal will be placed inside. The gantu should be tight enough that it should not open while steaming. The steamed gantus are given little touch of tamarind juice and chili. Can be consumed with akki roti, rice, chapathi or just as it is, again a dish prepared in the region of Hanbalu in Sakaleshpura. Thumbulai, a cool saaru usually made in summer using yogurt, ginger, pepper and other spices. Served with steamed rice. Maldi, a coarse cereal made from ground whole wheat, jaggery, black till and other ingredients. Usually served in a bowl with either milk or ghee. Erilu puti, a rice cereal made of ground toasted or puffed rice, jaggery, a lychee are pounded to powder thin. Usually served in a bowl with warm milk. This cereal is also used as a filling in a special dessert called harulu kadabu. Horulu kadabu, a traditional dessert made with erilu puti, jaggery, coconut and other ingredients. The mixture is shaped and steamed in turmeric leaves. Kadu Mavanahanina Saaru, a sweet and sour Saaru made with whole tiny ripe mangoes. Served with cooked rice. Kapi coffee fresh grounded, filtered coffee well mixed with thick milk and sugar. It's served at least five to six times a day in coffee growing regions of Malnad such as Somawarapete, Sakelshapura, Mudajir, Chikamagaluru Talik and western part of Bailur and Alor Taliks in Hassan. Topic. Kodagu cuisine Kodagu's staple food is rice. Traditional dishes include Pandi curry or pork curry Kadambutu or steamed rice dumplings Koli saaru or chicken curry Bimbale curry or bamboo shoot curry Paputu or steamed rice cake Nul putu and koli curry 
Topic: North Kanara Coastal Malinadu Karnataka Cuisine. Uttara Kannada North Kanara is known for a variety of seafood delicacies. The staple diet includes a portion of steamed rice and a vegetable and or seafood accompaniment. Seafood is immensely popular due to its ease of availability, and is prepared with a lot of local spices. Tea is the most popular beverage and is sometimes supplemented with cardamom or mint to give them a distinct flavor. Kadubu, the main ingredients are jackfruit pulp and jaggery. The batter is prepared and, with additional ingredients, the batter is put into a container and steamed. The dessert is a local delicacy and is served hot with ghee. Holage, these are stuffed wheat flour flatbreads. One variant is made with gram flour and jaggery, which is similar to the puran poli of Maharashtra. The other variant is made with a coconut-based filling. Tadadview, is a special kind of thin crust dosa made out of jaggery or sugarcane juice. Most local desserts of Circe have jaggery rather than sugar. Kesariboth, is rice cooked in sugar, ghee, and kesari. Karakali, is a special kind of chutney which tastes very spicy. It is prepared from colocasia leaves. Kote roti, a form of idli-like preparation, steam cooked in a conical-shaped container constructed using jackfruit leaves. Patrode, a special dish prepared by steaming stuffed colocasia leaves. Near dose, a soft thin pancake made of batter of boiled rice, coconut milk and salt. Kajmiji Koli kajaya and hosajer kajaya are made of rice flour and fried in oil as a famous dish often using roti. Often served with thick potato sambar or nati chicken curry, it is a delicacy among the non-vegetarian communities in Siddhapura. Banana buns Ankola koli saaru Appe huli Patholi Kalali masala Thumbulai tambli Rave roti Topic. Seafood Chipical suka clams fry. Kalga suka Dry fish chutney Dry prawns chutney Fish barbecue Crab curry jackfruit, banana chips, and fresh sugarcane juice are common ingredients in the area. Topic. Mangalorean coastal Karnataka cuisine Coconut is widely used in Mangalorean cuisine. Traditional Tuluva dishes include Cane fry or lady fish fry Anjal, surmai, kingfish fry Crab masala Bundas sukka, squid sukka Dry fish chutney Marwai, koyolu sukka shell fish. Kori sukka, chicken sukka Kori roti crisp flat rice pancake roasted on a griddle without oil. Can be stored up to six months. Usually served with chicken curry. Kori pundi Kundapura chicken, koli talu Kappa roti, odu dos Buns, goli baj, ambade Masala dosa Idli vada sambar Biscuit roti Patrode, a special dish prepared by steaming stuffed colocasia leaves. Near dosa, a soft thin pancake made of batter of boiled rice, coconut milk and salt Appam, garayapa padu, Coconut chutney Upatu Bija manoli upkari, or tenli and kashanitz porial Wheat halwa, kushmandu halwa Shira Sihi samabar Manaskai Jack fruit dishes Modaka und Mood, gunda Semij, shayavij rice noodle Mavina saaru preserved salted mango fruit cooked whole in a base of steam cooked tor dal, eaten with red rice or Indian bread. Sale, preserved salted jackfruit shallow fried with traditional oil mustard seasoning. Eaten as a snack, or as dry vegetable in a meal. Mani, is a traditional dessert made of rice, coconut and jaggery. It can also can be made of various flavors such as vegetables. Ol Bella palm jaggery. Halasina jackfruit hapala genesina sweet potato hapala Topic <inaudible> <inaudible> Navayath cuisine 
The Navayath cuisine can be primarily found in the coastal districts of Karnataka, mainly in Uttara Kannada and Udupi. Rice, coconut, seafood, eggs, poultry, and mutton are widely used in the Navayath cuisine. Traditional dishes include Ambit luka or fish curry prepared with coconut and spices. Chambat poli or flat rice pancake prepared by spreading batter on banana leaves and roasting on griddle with little oil. Usually served with mutton curry. Navari, a special dish prepared by spreading rice batter with coconut filling stuffed in turmeric leaves. Filling may be sweet or spicy and cooking may be by steaming or by roasting on a griddle. Shaufa panna appam, a soft thin pancake made of rice batter, coconut milk and fennel leaves. Mudkul rice dough cooked in prawn curry. Botkal biryani, made of fish, shrimps, chicken or mutton with rice. It is famous globally. Botkal halwa. Mushroom curry from seasonal natural mushrooms from nearby forests is a delicacy during monsoon season. Amatya godan or payasm, made of hog plum, rice flour, and jaggery cooked in coconut milk. Shinonya nevari is a preparation of rice and coconut batter filled in mussels with spices and steamed like idlis. See also Mavali Tiffin Room <laughs>